Hi guys, I'm Dr. Mike Cockrell and I want to thank you so much for joining me uh, here in this video series. You know, today's message I'm going to keep short and sweet. And really it's all about how we lie to ourselves. You know, we all do it and you're going to understand a little bit more about what I'm talking about in just a minute. But I was reading an article this morning. Um getting some of my daily motivation and, and some of my daily understanding out of the way. And Craig Ballantyne, the author of uh, Early to Rise, he actually hit the nail on the head with the comment he made. And so I thought I'd share that with you. And that was basically that at some point we all need to stop lying to ourselves. Now, we may do this in, in many different ways, but the one way in particular that we do it is by telling ourselves that we can't do something. And I know, it, you, you've been there, I've been there, we've all been there. Uh, we are introduced to things that we need to get done at work, we need to get done around the house, we need to get done in our lives, we need to do is with our diet, we need to do with our exercise program. And our excuse that's running in our head all the time is, I can't do that, I can't do that, I can't do that. When in fact, what we're probably really saying is, I'm not willing to do that, or I really don't want to do that. So one of the things, though, that happens from a psychological, from a mental standpoint, is when we constantly feed our subconscious mind, or even sometimes when someone outside that's telling us we can't do something, when we constantly are bombarded with that I can't do it attitude, that begins to shift your thinking, and over a period of time, it creates a pattern that leads you down a road that you may not want to be on. So, today, our challenge is very simply. First, I want you to start paying attention to how frequently you actually use the words or someone else that you know uses the words toward you, I can't. And every time you think it, every time you say it, if you say, I can't, if you think I can't, then immediately I want you to turn around and say to yourself, why not? So quit making excuses and start challenging yourself to really understand why you think you can't. Because I can tell you, you are, you are a powerful being and there is nothing that's possible that's been done by someone else ever in this lifetime that you can't do. You can do it, and you should do it if it fits with your purpose and your vision. So that's all today. I want you just to think out loud, you know, pay attention to the little things that are fueling your mind, and let's see if we can't start modifying some of those tiny little insults that go in there that over time basically steer us off course just enough that we are veering off of our our true purpose, and our true vision. So I hope this helps. I hope you have a great day. Uh, it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful week. Uh, fall is in the air, and life is wonderful. Have a great day. Love you guys. Bye-bye.